What's up, YouTube? If you're tuned in, you know what you're tuned in for. But the thing is, is today I'm doing it again. Home, homemade, 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 homemade. I should have took you to the store with me, but I didn't, because I didn't. So, excuse me. But yeah, for real. Thanks for tuning in if you tuned in. So, uh, sit back. Gonna whip up a little thing. Mexican pizza. Mexican pizza. I know Taco Bell took it off, but I'm not even doing it like Taco Bell. I'm gonna do it like a Mexican pizza I think should go. So, sit back, relax, enjoy a jazzy tune or something I got there. You know, I'm sure something's knocking. But word up. Thanks to everybody. Thanks to everybody that makes the music. Thanks to everybody. I gotta send shouts out. But word up, guys. So sit back, relax, and enjoy yourself. Until then. <sighs>
for the did you see all that that was taking place right there the whole thing taking place and we came out with the fishing pro the finished product finished product i thought it was pretty good actually it wasn't too long you saw the beans the meat the cheese look at that mexican pizza Mm. That's good. So, I, I would say it's more of a taco pizza. You saw what I did. I kind of... Mm. Excuse me. We use the Oaxaca cheese. Um, use the Fernandez seasoning. If you're from Colorado, that's an Alamosa based company, Fernanda Seasoning. And everybody's group, everybody's parents should have it, or anybody should have that in their that and garlic salt is the number one thing to have in a fridge. I think. I don't know. What do you think? But it's basically like a I'm not even gonna laugh. We got the idea for this from Taco Bell Mexican pizza. And we're like, oh, yeah, but I've never been a Mexican pizza fan. I remember growing up, it used to be like the, like you order like 20, the family pack. And you can get it with the Mexican pizza. And the Mexican pizza was always like, I always just remember seeing that thing sitting around for days after. Where, but we're out. The crust. Quick, one of those little instant instant pizza crust they're not bad at all but i mean that's a good pizza if you like tacos and you mix it with pizza this is good i used the ohawk cheese and i could have used i could have probably used sour cream on it but i'm one of the people that are like if you're using cheese why would you use sour cream like why would you use crema if you use cheese it's just weird. That heck of mm. Thank y'all for tuning in. This was just a quick, um, a quick kind of meal type of thing. And it probably took 20 minutes, half hour. So, you know, it's a quick minute meal, you know, whether you're alone, whether you want to make it with your lady or you know, your kids or whatever. Good little recipe. You saw the things, you just mash it all up together. You know what I mean? Get the the pizza dough, the bean, the meat, cook it with some alpato, you know? Then you get them beans. You could get the can of beans because why refry them yourself? You could do it yourself and it's better. That was a can of pinto beans, you know, a little bit bit of Fernandez seasoning um stuff like that and you know put it together bake it for 10 minutes and okay don't forget to pre-bake the the pizza crust though before you put all the stuff on it pre-bake it I forget what they call that and I'm sure somebody's gonna tell me oh there it is uh, but and yeah and then uh you put the stuff on it then bake it Unless you're doing like really old school, like I think Italian pizza crust, like, or whatever. But heck yeah, guys. Thank you uh, for tuning in. Um, I'll have more stuff out. Um, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that little bell. So you'll be notified every time I drop something new. But word up, guys, till we see each other again. Hey, be safe.